I hope you're all feeling alright today because I am Tickety Boo! And today we've got the Cameroon Squad Builder, the first Squad Builder of this season's FIFA on the channel. We're going to get straight into it right now with some lovely looking cards. We've got Ona as the goalkeeper. Very solid to say he's only 79 rated. Isn't as good as some of the 80 plus keepers on the game, but he is decent all the same. A tip, a silver, pretty solid, quite quick, six foot one, one his headers, pretty solid as part of a back three. And the big Matip, the informed version, very, very good. One of the best center outs I've used on the game and wins every single header. We have got alongside him Nakulu, one of the FIFA favorites for a good few years. Serie A staple, pretty quick, strong, defensively good. Good as part of the back three. We've got Boomal on the right hand side, the another silver with 85 pace, six foot tall, pretty athletic, and did chip in with a decent goal as well. Anguasia, the Fulham player, is pretty good physically, strong in the tackle, but his passing does let him down a little bit. Mbia alongside was better, six foot two, an absolute powerhouse. Just what you want from a CDM to absolutely destroy the opposition forwards at every opportunity. We've got Chupa Motin, the Champions League version. He's got 78 pace, good passing, a very good finish from that side and can cut in on that good weak foot as well. We've got Mukanjo, who is a striker by trade. I changed it to Cam just so I could use that absolute blistering pace and it worked out an absolute treat. Really good finishing, better passing than I expected and the pace was Perfect. Tokuwa Kambi, again, an absolute powerhouse. Physically good. Good striker of the ball. Linked up very, very well. And the star of the team, Abu Pakar, the Champions League version. Absolute beast. Very cheap card. If you're using a Portuguese side, put him in there because he's very, very effective. Scored everything, whether it balls in the air or over the top in behind. Also, the honourable mentions, we've got Song, who came on a few times, did pretty well when he did, uh, just to freshen it up with those legs because there's a lot of running done with this side. Alongside him, we also used the former Spurs player in GA. Did manage to get a goal for me as well, which I was pretty impressed by. So let's get on to the highlights. So here we have the penalty for Mbia, one of my stalwarts at CDM. We've got a lovely finish there from Boomal coming in from that right-hand side. Another silver doing very, very well. Was impressed with him. And there we have Mukanju doing what he did best, zipping from midfield with that pace, getting into positions where he's going to trouble defenders and getting shots away. And here he is, Chupamoting with a fine finish on that left foot, having come in from the left-hand side. The side works very, very well, using the pace where it's needed, like this, pushing the ball wide, getting balls into the box, and the forward players were very, very good in the air, whether it was the front two or Mukanju coming in at that camp position. Those front three did a lot of sides, a lot of damage. Here is Toko Akambi, a very calm finish for, again, an athletic forward line with lots of pace, lots of power, and lots of strength. And the highlight of that was that front three combination. Cannot say it enough. If you're going to try that out, even if you don't use the rest of the side, the front three are very, very impressive. They link very, very well. And Abubakar, as you can see here, is one of the better strikers I've used on the game so far. And I kid you not. And he's absolutely dirt, dirt cheap. Hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, drop a like, subscribe, and comment if you've used any of the Cameroon guys I've used today. I've been Dango. Catch you all later, guys.